Jonah Team Yalaba, Tony the Good morning everyone, it's Tony. Now the reason why I'm obviously whispering is because I'm actually not, if you can tell already from the background behind me, at my regular setup for my reactions. I'm actually at family right now, and that's because of the holidays and everything. And by the way, happy holidays and happy early New Year's to everybody. Hopefully 2021 is better for everybody in contrast to 2020. And with that being said, obviously I don't have the uh, capacity to make the edits and everything that I usually do, but I still want to get this out for you. And this one being a group i've actually taken a quick hiatus almost as if you could say on uh, doing reactions for it because it's been a hot minute since i last reacted to txt tomorrow x together the last time we did i believe was can't you see me which was a hot like seven months ago and if you want to go check out my reaction to that i'll leave it linked in the description box below but apart from that we missed out on puma we missed out on um what was it blue hour and we just missed out most recently on we lost the summer which happens to be the song that we're going to be checking out today for a dance practice which is really really cool i've actually listened to both of the title tracks i guess you could say for the actual album that they most recently released and to that note also puma was okay i think can't you see me was my preference over puma for the two like tracks that they kind of made music videos for for that album and then coming to this album we lost the summer is my personal preference over blue hour i feel like blue hour is personally just not my cup of tea music but like that being said i still really appreciate kind of like the liveliness and the different style that uh txt brings when you compare them to both bts as well as n-hyphen which are their like brother groups as well so with that being said let's not waste any more time and let's finally get into the dance practice for we lost the summer so the thing with txt's music i'm going to be mentioning of music too since i didn't react to the music video is that i love the idea of like their aspects of being like more floral a bit more pretty boy a bit more kind of just light-hearted their music is i that that's why i really like about it. it's a different kind of thematic compared to like uh in hype and then also bts if you were to compare i think that txt is kind of like a meshing between the two their synchronicity is so nice like even that little step right there that little step right there this little point they do this a lot like they have such kind of like power in those little movements that they do they're so well synchronized and that's what i was really impressed with with their debut song crown was that a knocking sound or i think that was a knocking sound for me. i love that dynamics too because like they're really the first group I ever noticed that like does like kind of like jumps over top of each other, lifts, kind of like intricate kind of choreography like this. It was really cool. I th I really enjoy always the choreography of this group. Like their formations are so tight and clean, and then the dis like the transition in out. Like they literally went from just being in like a triangle. To now being to like a circle and they made that so seamless the transitions very very smooth man oh my god i don't like of an exotic vibe this song too the sound the chorus is my favorite part chorus is kind of very smooth kind of like very calming but at the same time very powerful still and the underlying beat of like the exotic tone is still there but it's building now we, the whole song has this such angelic vocals i find each movement's so dynamic so poppy So like even though they seem like such little movement right here in the chorus, it's very like intricate, every little detail. And it's so synchronized that that's what I think really makes like the spectacle for this. They take the little things and make them so perfect that they really stand out and they really capture your attention and they make it seem so much more complex and difficult than it actually is. Like granted, I don't know how to dance well, but like I'm saying this because like from what I'm seeing, it's not like the crazy like hand tuttings we see in other groups as well. Like so intricate, like these little moments. Little... 
like even that little section right there where he where they all turn it takes a lot of practice to know who like what how many turns you do like, like they'll spin but he in particular knows that he has to hit that it's just really cool those little details of that I like how they focus on every little member by like hiding the backs of everybody else too. That's something I've noticed a lot of like big hit groups do in particular. Ooh, did you hear that? Like da da. Like the the vocals I hear are just really so so nice. And another thing I've been noticing, I know this room is another same room that I think G Friend used in one of their dance videos. And I'm noticing these guys are hitting a lot of the height, like the line, a lot higher than G Friend, obviously because they're guys. But like apparently these guys are really really tall. So yeah, yeah. I'm just putting in perspective everything too. Side tra side track. I don't know why. I said that. It's building up, like that underlying tone of exotic is still there, but there's like other more beat. The drums. Ooh. There's like also like maybe like an orchestra kind of vibe. Oh, I like the synth, the synth, like the synth kind of like eh, here with it makes it a little bit more melodic, a bit more kind of like the slowy kind of more emotional section of the song. And there's always this one section I noticed from a TXT title track or like a B side track to that. Very clean. It's still sticking. The same thing with the choreography, kind of sticking with the formations that I know from TXT with like the jumping and everything. But again, everything is so brand new to me still. It's a very kind of like dynamic, still very playful, very young, but still very kind of like powerful, very kind of like massive masculine and it really feels like this has been more than just one year that these guys have been debuting which has really kind of like been almost two years but like still this is like their one year this is like their full year of kind of like being a group now after debut look at the goal of stairs they're giving us can we go back like the speed ups to slow downs are really nice they deceleration actually it's so oh the high note here, the sustain. Like they're so in sync. It's really impressive, man. It's awesome. Even like the head thing, it's so cool. like if you could hear it if you listen very close yo they're like panting because that's how crazy that's how like intense this choreography is and it totally makes sense because i can definitely see all the jumping all the movement all like the crazy running around almost to an extent but like they hide it so well they make it seem like such a kind of like simplistic and that's what i'm referring to again by like they make the little movements seem so simple but they're actually very complex very very had to be like practiced out and everything very synchronized very intricate and that's what i can really appreciate every time i see a txt dance practice or just a performance so that it's so dynamic but they make it seem so smooth so simple and i just love everything about this performance in particular because uh, we lost the summer as i mentioned is one of my particular favorite songs off this new album really really clean really fun song really playful song and again a different kind of take when you compare to in hype and when you compare to bts their brother groups very different but still has that kind of like really like de defined it txt dna to it i think that the, both the dancing their choreography as well as their music styling has kind of like a defined tone to it but i think it's a really suitable tone for them and they kind of mix it up here and there so i like how there's like something always new being brought into it this one in particular really really solid nice like high pitch vocals nice solid vocals and less kind of like of the deeper tones which i think really suited the song in particular but overall really 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 loved it so yeah guys hopefully you do stay tuned for more txt i know it's been like a quick minute since i last checked them out but hopefully get this makes up for it and as i mentioned if you want to go check out my reaction to can't you see me it'll be linked in the description box below and yeah with that being said guys happy holidays happy early new year and if i don't see you in another video for the rest of this year happy new year and hope to see you in 2021 and hope that it's better than 2020 see you later bye bye, -bye.